90% of the time, you're gonna end up getting swept, okay? So you have to prevent that and be extra quick or pull it out, okay? So uh, before I go into that again, um, one of the students mentioned the, uh, the elbows too. So if let's say I'm doing that drill that I was doing here, and then I come over here, remember, his elbow is right there. All he has to do is collapse his arm and boom. So to make it a little safer, you gotta go out further. So here, up. So I'm going really far out. Far out here, and then I'm coming up, okay? So just pull your head out uh, further. And obviously you gotta do it with speed. Everything has to be done with speed, okay? All right, so again, he gets me in this position. First thing I do, as soon as he does that, I'm right here, okay? And then I'm back to uh, this position. Now, if he does lock me in, okay? The fight's not over, I can still do some things, okay? So what I can do is take my tricep, <coughs> go right here, and Ooh. pull him down, okay? And then knee, all right? So what I'm doing is I'm not going horizontal, I'm going down, because that's where I have more power. If I go this way, I don't have as much muscle power as going this way, and then watch. See my hip as well? Don't be looking at my butt. <laughs> <laughs> so watch, I'm doing this. You see my hip, how it's doing this? So I'm using my whole body, not just this. If I do this, I may not be strong enough, so I'm doing that, okay? And then, I'm, again, I'm setting myself up for the knee, all right? Um, uh, that's pretty much it. <laughs>